you didn't do so well in my oxidation states quiz, let me explain. Starting with O2, this is just elemental oxygen and all elements, when they're just by themselves, will have an oxidation state of zero. In most compounds, oxygen has an oxidation state of minus two. And we can double check that because hydrogen has an oxidation state here of plus one, two of them, and the overall charge of the molecule is neutral. And so the oxidation states need to cancel out. F2O, it's going to take the minus one oxidation state. Now, because there are two of them, that's contributing minus two, meaning that the oxygen must have an oxidation state of plus two. Then we get to sodium peroxide. And as soon as I said peroxide, the answer should pop out to you. But again, we can use the oxidation state of the sodium, which is plus one. There are two of them making that plus two, which means that the oxygens must be contributing minus two. There are two of them. So that means each must, be, must have an oxidation state of minus one. And finally, is it a bird? Is it a plane? No, it's a superoxide. Here we have NaO2, where again, the sodium has an oxidation state of plus one, meaning that the oxygen is contributing minus one. There are two of them, which means that the average oxidation state must be minus a half. Follow me for more chemistry content like this.